you know, this is the, I think, I thought you would, uh, your best place to do that, but I mean, to say, first of all, uh, to everybody that's gathered here, I know that they, uh, my, my, I was nervous as we were preparing for this event about the turnout, and I kept also reassuring myself in my nervousness that um, of the saying, I think it, uh, it comes from Lenin originally, which says, uh, fewer but better. So that, I mean, with a few of us here, at least we can begin a movement, a, a catalytic kind of movement, to come to terms with how, um, to, 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 for lack of a better word, to disabuse ourselves of the idea that our liberation, our salvation lies with the elites that run uh, the political offices of our countries, that we have to reclaim our agency because we had outsourced that agency in, in the moment of 1994. And it's important for us to reclaim it. It's important for us to draw from Zala and perhaps if anything uh, to inspire us, it is this idea that uh, we need to go back to basics to our communities to build people's power. I mean, there was a time in this country when street committees were almost kind of an alternative form of government and even effective at that, not only in curbing crime, but also in beginning to develop discussions around how to uh, create communities that are healthy, that can eat health. Somebody spoke about the diet, I think it was Tandy. Um, so it's things like that. So I hope that at least that message uh, if anything, we take out of the inspiration uh, of, of, of Muzala. One of the most um, inspiring things for me was the fact that even when he writes and in, his, in, in a loneliness where he feels that there's no response to his article, he will respond to his original article using a different pseudonym and challenge the issues and deal with them. And then even retort again, you know, over and above these articles with a third using a different pseudonym and have a discussion and a, a debate, a polemic with himself. So it's that kind of, and I hope that the youth can draw inspiration from that as we face uh, what I could call like very difficult and challenging times, but times that we can, we were able to do it before, we can still uh, do it today. Uh, with those few words, I'd like to thank you uh, all for making uh, this event. And then uh, there is uh, there are refreshments outside, and also, as Robin said, the books are available for sale at the back.